Middlesex County's Historic Artifacts series continues with Episode 4, A Wig and Wig Stand. Pastors or prominent men or even craftsmen wore short wigs with a silk ribbon that tied the hair tail. Wigs were first popular in France in the early to mid-1600s and became fashionable in England after the restoration of Charles II in 1660. Gentlemen used wigs to mask their baldness. They also used it to mask the gray in their hair. To prepare a gentleman for a wig, the barber shaved the head, and the same barber would fit the gentleman with a wig of whatever hair color they chose. Brown was the most fashionable in the late 17th century. The wig stand was carved out of pine. The cap over the head was at first made of cloth. Years later, it was made of animal skin. While on a gentleman's head, wigs were powdered by wheat flour, but styled with hog fat. Wigs could not be washed with water because it caused the wig hair to fall out, so alcohol was used. By the late 18th century, wigs were no longer fashionable. Thank you for watching this episode of Middlesex County's Historic Artifacts series. This episode is brought to you by the Middlesex County Board of Chosen Freeholders, the Middlesex County Office of Arts and History, and the New Jersey Historical Commission, a division of the Department of State.